Good morning, America. Uh, my name is Stu Scheller, Sr. I'm Kathy Scheller. We are the parents of Lieutenant Colonel Stuart Scheller and three other children and grandparents of 12. And we're taking the time today to take a little pause from our ranting and raging, asking for help from America. And we want to take a pause and say thank you. Thank you to our veterans. Thank you, America. Thank you for standing and helping us during this very trying time. We want to take a moment to thank all of those people who have, are currently serving and who have served in the past. There is a serious disconnect between the American people and those who have served. About 71% of Americans today between the ages of 17 and 24 are not even eligible to serve, either due to medical uh, intelligence or tattoo issues. Um, and there's only 1% of Americans actually have served, and there's a very large disconnect between what's going on in the military, what it takes to serve, not only for the person who is serving, but for the family at home, the, the spouses, the children, the parents. Um, it is take, not only is that one person deployed, but the entire family is deployed, and we want to recognize that today. So it is Veterans Week this week, and we would ask you to not just thank a veteran for their service, talk to them, ask them how they're feeling, ask them how they're doing, how are they doing now that they're out of the military, ask them uh, how their life is, uh, just listen to them, show the love, because these proud veterans have fought for your freedom, have served for your freedom. And so we wanna honor them this week. We wanna honor all the Gold Star families, especially the 13 Gold Star families from the August 26th Kabul uh, suicide bombing. We wanna thank you for your service. We know you're still in pain and we are sorry, so sorry for your loss. And we also want to honor those people who were injured who are still in the hospital facing years, and I'm not saying months, years of surgeries ahead of them who have lost limbs and injuries and infections. Please continue to pray for those families as they heal. We'd ask you to pray for those Americans and green heart card holders that are still left behind in Afghanistan. They need to be out. It's not a safe place for them. And I'd just like to thank you for all of the support. The people that have reached out to us through social media, through messenger, through, through email, you have lifted our spirits and kept us going through a very dark, dark time for us. I'm sorry, this is very emotional for me. This, is, this does affect families. And we wanna thank you all and all those veterans and our active duty. We have over a million active duty. Now we know most active duties can't show support right now for Lieutenant Colonel Stuart Scheller. We get that. But we know that in our hearts, you know what he did was right. And we just want to say thank you for all of your support. We feel it. And we want to wish you all a great Veterans Week. Yes, and support those veterans and support all of their causes and really take time to listen to their stories so that we never forget. Thank you. Thank you.